A lot of our clients right now have had to deal with the challenges. How do you run a business in a coronavirus world? And that's not a simple thing. One thing I don't like is the term social distancing. Right now, relationships matter more than ever. I don't want to be distant from my clients. I do need to make sure we maintain some physical distance to keep people safe. good about keeping the big three in mind, containment, dispersal, and virtualization. So containment means how do I separate or isolate things in what I'm doing? So in the past where I would have had people come in and they would have used menus, now is a great time to consider how can I have that up on a board? How can I have that be something that they can pull up on their smartphone right there at that moment? How do I disperse? Do I have ships? Do I change how people work? One of the manufacturers that we coach, they've created three different lunch times for each shift so they can have a third of the people at each moment in time they go in to actually eat. How can I do online reservations? And so when people are ready, I can have them not waiting there, but I can text them when we're ready. And then virtualization says, what can I do virtually versus doing it where there's physical presence? One of the landscape companies created a way to give instant quotes to homeowners. He doubled his client base in one month period of time because people didn't want to be physically having someone come over so containment, dispersal, and virtualization are the principles we want to use to keep our staff and our customers safe. Your marketplace needs to know what are you doing to keep me safe. So when you're thinking about how you're going to communicate this with your staff and your customers, every consumer, every staff member has a dialogue going on. Am I going to be safe? Is this okay? Can I do this contactless? That's the hidden dialogue that's in their head. And as long as you can speak to that dialogue, then you're gonna find that both your staff and your customers are gonna be much more comfortable coming in and giving business to your business. We don't know what's going to be happening in the world, but one thing I know is that as a small business, one of the big advantages that you have over large enterprise is that you can actually make these creative changes to find the hidden opportunities for your business, and they are there.